This column is the fourth and final one in this series. Last week's dealt with some of the overarching problems that need to be worked through as the resistance develops and gathers force. This one presents some specifics on some of the large set of tasks that need to be undertaken, if this repeal and replace movement is to be successful. One, The enemy, in the current struggle against trumpet functional fascism, must be clearly identified. It is the trumpet slash repub party. Indeed, especially as some of the old line repubs leave the party, it must be very firmly tied to Trump. Trump's base that is always being talked about in terms of Trump must listen to his base is the Republican Party base. They are not separate. They are not different. Any so-called centrist or center-rightist Republicans who remain where they are, are Trumpet enablers, as were the center and traditional right-wing parties in Nazi Germany. Two, Addressing Trump himself the focus must be on his policies and their outcomes, not his personality, his ignorance, his stupidity as so labeled by senior cabinet members, his sexually predatorial nature, his personal racism, his eating habits, his TV watching habits, and so on and so forth. Those are all part of the aura of Trump which proves so useful to him and his facilitators, as distractions from what he is really doing in terms of policy and programs.